Kansas City. This is KCTV 5 News at 6. People taking advantage of this gorgeous day in the metro, and there's a chance we could see a little rain. Meteorologist Jesse Hawila will tell us where. They want change. They want something different. Winners and losers. Who voters picked at today's caucus and which races still stand in the balance? Plus, long lines as caucus goers rush to pick their favorite for their party's nomination. Why people were very happy to wait. But first, we have a winner tonight. Kansas Republicans picking Senator Ted Cruz. You can see 51% there to Donald Trump's 24%. Marco Rubio with 14% and John Kasich with 9%. And the votes are still being tallied on the Democratic side at this point. Um, we're going to get those numbers to you just as soon as we can. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Amy Anderson. Campaign 2016 is in full swing, and today voters got a chance to cast their vote in Kansas. We have in-depth coverage on this caucus day. KCTV5's Natalie Davis is live in Olathe covering the Republican turnout, and Elizabeth Rentschler is live in Roland Park covering the Democrats. We begin tonight with KCTV5's Natalie Davis. She has been watching the Republican caucus where voters flocked to vote for their candidate today. Natalie. So many Republicans voted today. They nearly broke the internet. A lot of Kansas caucus locations had trouble with slow Wi Fi connection, majorly slowing down the process. Here at Olathe South, hundreds of people crammed inside at any given time. The line stretched out the door and all the way around this building. We, are, we have not moved in 45 minutes. The wait was long, but that didn't stop thousands of Republicans from having their say. I think it's incredibly important to come and be a part of this process. Um, just as a citizen of the United States, it's one of your duties. It's one of your responsibilities. The Internet was slow, causing a big backup in the line. It was hot. It was crowded. But somehow, people were still smiling. I finally got my little sticker and ready to vote. So, But it's good that we've got a great turnout. That means other people are ready for a change as well. Everyone wants their vote counted, especially this year. You know, I think the American people are kind of riled up this, this season um, for whatever reason, and it's, it's really exciting to see it. I just think that, you know, we're all kind of like, okay, we got to get up and do this. 32,000 Kansans participated in the caucus in 2012. The official numbers for this year aren't out yet, but the Kansas Republican Party says right now they're projecting three times that amount. And looking at the lines in Olathe, I doubt anyone would be shocked. Now, I did a quick little survey of the last people walking out the door after they voted. Some of them waited two, three plus hours to cast their vote, and somehow they were still smiling, happy to participate. Live in Olathe, Natalie Davis, KCTV 5 News. All right, Natalie, thank you. Democrats also had a 